So today I'm going to go over how to do a proper chin up. Now we're focusing on arms today. So a lot of people don't realize that chin ups are a great bicep workout. They think of it more towards a back exercise. So with a, with a chin up, your, your fists are going to face you as opposed to a pull up where your fists are away. You're going to turn them in, probably closer grip and keep them towards you. I'll show you in a second how to do it. Now as you pull up, to keep a focus on your bicep, you're really gonna squeeze your biceps in as you pull your body up and release slowly. Now instead of just pulling up and dropping down, that won't put any work into your bicep, it'll be worthless. So keep concentration in your biceps as you pull up, you're gonna squeeze when you hit the top and you're gonna re release yourself down slowly as opposed to just dropping because the negative is very important to work in any kind of workout. You'll get twice the benefit out of the, out of the size, out of the strength, if you still continue to work on the, that negative, the release. Breathing, you always breathe out when you work against gravity. So as you're pulling up, working against gravity, you're breathing out. Releasing, coming back. There's a lot of bad habits that go into champs too. A lot of swinging, you're kicking your legs up with it. You wanna stay stable. Okay, you want to keep everything tight. Make sure that all the focus is in your bicep because we're doing arms. We're not trying to work our backs too much. You're going to just because it's a pull up. Now, I'll show you. So it's underhand, pull up, squeeze it, come down slow, control. Don't lock out, keep a nice bend. Come up, squeeze, down control. Now, if you can get 10, 15 reps of that, you're in a good position to get some good size, good strength. If you can do more, maybe you could add some weight to yourself. Either hold dumbbells in your feet, or there's a belt that you can add a weight to with a chain. If this is too difficult, if you can't get those 10 reps, there's assisted machines out there that exist where it'll take a percentage of your body weight. So you can still perform the right motion and do the right exercise, but it's a little easier, it's a little lighter. Sometimes at the end of an arm workout, I can't even do a regular pull-up. So I'll go to the assisted and I'll do my pull-ups, my chin-ups, I'm sorry, on a, an assisted machine. Again, great for your biceps, great for size, great for strength, good results. And that's a chin-up.